sometimes if you have too many options, it can spoil you. It can it can change your your DNA. Uh, Will Smith actually was talking about happiness and money and all that, and he said, uh, "I hope that everybody gets the blessing of knowing what it feels like to have everything you want and to have all those options, because then you find out that your happiness doesn't come from out there; it comes from inside." So uh, a lot of times. Rising up the wealth ladder means you also have to rise up the ladder of spirituality. Uh, if you're vibrating on a higher financial frequency, you got a higher vibrating on a higher spiritual frequency. So that, for example, if you get to the point where you do have a lot of options and you are like the kid in the candy store, you are wise enough and you have enough economic vision and enough financial consciousness to not feel like you have to take advantage of every opportunity or eat every piece of candy in the store, because a wise person knows that. If I have a lot of options, if I exercise too many options, uh, like if I sleep with too many women, that's going to lead to bad outcomes. If I buy too many, too much material stuff, that's going to ruin me financially. Uh, so, so just because you have the options doesn't mean you have to exercise them. So a lot of your spiritual development isn't just in having enough insight to create options for yourself. It is having enough insight to know when to say yes and when to say no. Um, I can give a real life scenario on this. You'd be amazed. You'd be amazed at how much access I got. I get from being Dr. Boyce Watkins. Uh, I I was one of the first people to be doing like this, all this financial stuff online. I've been doing it since 2008 or so. And uh, when I got well, more well known, I was really fascinated by how easy it was for me to get things done. How many options I had. How many people would just invite me in and trust me and want to do things for me just because um, of who I was. Or how many women wanted to date me? There were a lot of women that wanted to date me, right? I don't know why. I have no idea. But but they were interested. And I remember even then thinking to myself, okay, you know, settle down, boys. Like the, the internal dialogue is like, don't go chasing waterfalls. You know, don't go jumping into every situation, jumping in bed with every every lady, whatever, because because there's a, there's a dark side to everything. Karma is real. Right. So uh, while I enjoyed having the options, I enjoyed the fact that I had some privilege that I worked hard for. I never allowed myself to get carried away with that ever. So uh, options are valuable. You should create them for yourself. But you also want to have enough spiritual discernment to know that that sometimes uh, the devil can bless you, too. Like my friend D1 likes to say, the devil can bless you, too. So when the devil's blessing you with all these options, just be mindful of of, of what what can come from that. OK, so. Give me a second. Let me let me take a minute to choke. Um, I didn't know my my sinuses would be this stopped up. I need to go take some medication. So so let's let's talk about this thing with Novo Nordisk, the the weight loss drug. 